Leaders may have been the keynotes for the Ag Outlook Forum, but they weren't the only highlight. RFD TV Sarah Mock is on scene in Arlington, Virginia. She joins us now with an update on Canadian agriculture. Sarah? <laughs> Well, of course, trade in the North American neighborhood was a big focus of this year's uh, event here in Arlington, Virginia. We're lucky to be joined by Keith Curry. He is the president of the Ontario Federation of Agriculture. Keith, give us kind of your reaction to what you heard, what you've heard so far at Outlook about kind of the relationship with U.S. and Canada on agriculture. Well, I think trade in general is a big focus of this conference because it's important to to not only agriculture in the U.S. but around the world. I mean, it's a, it's a common commodity that we all trade, and so um, I'm happy to listen to what's coming from this side of the border uh, to help us understand how we need to continue to work with our partners, our neighbors to the south and, and make those relationships even stronger. Absolutely. Now, of course, we have a new trade deal on the on the horizon that's been negotiated between our, our uh, two or three countries with Mexico, of course. Uh, talk to us a little bit about how that was received amongst farmers uh, where you farm. Well, it varies across commodity. Essentially, by and large, there's a relief that there's a deal done. Uh, we've had a tremendous relationship for the last 20 plus years with, with NAFTA. Uh, integration of our systems is incredible, so we don't want to see that flow, that economic uh, key economic development stuff that's happening because of further value added on products. Yes, there were some banks from our supply and managed side who were worried about giving up uh, additional access to, to their markets. But on the flip side, you've got uh, commodities like beef and pork, for example, they're quite happy to have a deal done so they continue to have their products flow back and forth. So it's, it's a little bit of mixed reaction, but by and large, there's the relief that it's done. I wonder if you could speak a little bit as well. I think there's we tend to get in the weeds a bit about there's just so many trade deals that the U.S. is working on with, with countries across the globe, but Canada has deals that it's working on with folks outside of the U.S. as well. Could you talk a little bit about how you guys have been affected by uh, deals that have been completed recently or, or that are kind of in the pipeline right now? Yeah, sure. Uh, certainly CPTPP is a big one. I know that the U.S. has not been part of that now. They've pulled out, uh, which is, you know, we look at that as unfortunate because they are one of our bigger trading trading partners, but it's a, it's a huge market access for us, uh, along with the, uh, the uh, CETA deal, which is a European deal trade agreement that we, we completed about three years ago. So these markets are very integral to uh, us moving our products and, and not relying on a single market in order for us to have to uh, sell, our, sell our goods to. So, uh, you know, getting uh, other trading partners is important because uh, we may not always have the, a product that somebody wants, but if we can get in a three-way, four-way, five-way deal, that makes flow of products for everybody much easier and much more easy to get a deal done. Absolutely. Well, as trade talks move forward, there will be farmers on both sides of the border watching as these discussions uh, evolve over the coming months. Uh, thanks again to Keith Curry for joining us today. We'll have more updates for you. One last update this morning. Until then, back to you. Looking forward to that next update. Thank you so much, Sarah. And stay tuned. Like she said, we're going to go back to the forum to get another update from a farmer, the UK. 1 p.m. Eastern. Stay tuned for that. The overall U.S. economy remains steady, but recent consumer confidence reports are down. And experts say the decline could threaten a fragile farm economy.